Hi, this is Gavin with Remax Action First, and I'm taking a video of a unit in the preserve at on top of the world condos. This corner unit is for sale, it's 1400 square feet, and it's a corner unit, so that means there's additional windows on the side, which obviously no interior unit can have. As you can see, those windows are all looking out of the unit. And this is a ground floor unit, of course. This is the patio, which is very private. It's a very nice, nice little outside area. The sun's a little bright, so this video might not be coming out as well. But uh, getting back in the sun, you can see how well kept it is. And there's a look at your patio right there with the screen door on the back. Now this is very uh, unique and you hear that a lot about properties but this really is on top of the world. Usually it has a little patio on the, on the uh, ground floor of the units but this is unlike almost anything out there because of the fact that it's so private and you get all of the space right here as well as your own patio area. And as you can see you can't see any of the interior units so it's a very unusual feature to one of these units. This is a completely blocked building, as you can see there. No wood frame. And going inside, this is a little dining area, eat-in area from the kitchen. And to the right is the kitchen itself with Korean countertops. You can see it's in mint condition. I'm just going to give you a tour as though you were there yourself. That's the best way to do it. And I find that video is by far the best way to convey a um, property. And give you a real feeling. A walkthrough video. Professional videos using pictures doesn't do it. This is the living area, and as you can see, those bay windows, which uh, look outside, other units, except for other corners, units just don't have it. Quite a lot of space there. Nice hallway, unique rounded corners. I'll take a walk backwards in the living area. You can see the master bedroom in the background. Master bedroom is very spacious. It's about 15 by 14. Large windows, so it's very bright if you open that up. There's the ensuite bathroom, and this is a nice walk in closet, which a lot of you would really appreciate. Master bathroom as well is in mint condition, tiled floors, full walk-in shower. It's got a ledge to sit on and put all your stuff on. Fully tiled as well, super clean. This unit definitely shows pride of ownership. It was uh, kept immaculately by the owners. And back out to the master bedroom. And the hallway to the front door. We started this a little backwards, but I'm going to take a look into the laundry room quickly. Really good size, a lot of storage. That's where the uh, fuse box is, electrical box. And there's the uh, washer and dryer. This is bedroom number two. Again, you can see it's very, very spacious. Nice ceilings. And it has a decent sized closet, although not a walk-in. 
And there is not a light in there, but gives you kind of an idea. And up to the third bedroom. As you can see again, very spacious. All the bedrooms in here are very spacious. Gives you uh, definitely ample room to put your king size bed, a king size bed in each room if you wanted to, and furniture. A uh, third bedroom, of course, could be a library or a den, depending on your needs. This is the guest bathroom or second bathroom. Again, you can see it's in mint condition. And we'll have a look inside the shower. And that's about it for the uh, tour of the unit. Um, let's give you a different perspective of the living room. And back to the kitchen again. So here's an interesting fact about on top of the world that most people don't know. It is actually the largest condominium complex in the country. It has well over 3,000 units. Not sure the exact number, but it's well over 3,000 units. I'm just coming back out here again because I wanted to take a walk through on the floors. These floors are very unique. If you're looking at them right now, you'll probably think of these uh, wood floors. And in a way they are, but they are actually something called NAFCO, which is a very, very high-end laminate. And unlike a regular laminate that just uh, is, is, is um, you just put down over the floor, this actually has a uh, rubber underside to it. So it's a, it's a fascinating type of flooring. You can see it's very shiny and glossy, and it stays that way. It requires very little maintenance. It's called NAFCO, if you wanted to look that up. But the uh, rubber underneath, which is a good eighth of an inch, is uh, great because it eliminates noise when you're walking and gives you a little cushion and makes it easier on the surface. So that's just an interesting point you might want to uh, keep in mind. It's a very durable, so you're thinking of a normal laminate, they're normally very inexpensive and come up and so on off of the floor, but this will not. This is a very, very high grade. In fact, it's, uh, I believe it's actually technically a vinyl, the, uh, the surface. So that's about it except for the windows. I wanted to point out that these are uh, new windows within three years. Let me just open this up. These are all double paned windows. These are not the, and as you see, you get a nice view on the outside there. Nice bright sunny day. But these windows are uh, highest class you can get. They actually, I'm not going to do it right now, but of course they open straight up, but you can also pull them up and push them out so you can wash the outside of the windows from the inside, if that makes sense. And you got the screen door on the back so you can leave the doors open on the nice cool summer days, or rather winter days, not too many cool summer days, but uh, so you can leave the windows open and the, with the screens and the door open along with the front door. And that'll give you a nice uh, blow through without worrying about bugs or anything like that. So the windows are about three years old. It's a unit, uh, very expensive to do, as you would find out in Florida, or maybe you have already. The front door for a second. And just mention that the air conditioner is only um, about seven or eight years old. That one with the red car, that's a parking spot right outside the front door of the unit. It's very nice greenery and as you can see it's a more modern building. 
more modern building because it was built in 1995, which is what this whole gated section of top of the world was built in, or when it was built in. And uh, the rest of top of the world is for the most part built in the 70s and 80s. So there you have it. My name is Gavin with Remax Action First. If you'd like to find more about this property or any other properties, please give me a uh, shout, contact me. My website is very easy. It's gavin.realtor. That's gavin.r-e-a-l-t-o-r. Or website, oh, sorry, the uh, phone number is 727-564-2488. And uh, you can text me on that or call me. So hopefully that was pretty much like a 10 minute walkthrough for you as you would uh, if you have seen the unit. If you have any other questions about anything, uh, give me a shout and I can answer them for you. Other than that, have a great day and we'll see you soon.